An Arctic blast is spreading potentially life-threatening cold across the Midwest. Millions of Americans are gearing up for what could be the lowest temperatures in more than two decades. CBS 4's Mark Liverman has more. A bitter blast of weather is already in effect for much of the Midwest. As meteorologists warn, this is just the tip of the iceberg. A polar vortex will cause bone-chilling temperatures to plummet even lower, bringing threats of hypothermia and frostbite into next weekend. I have on three sweatshirts under here and two t-shirts, and then I'm wearing three pair of thermals. So, you know, you got to be prepared when you get out here. We've seen an increase in about uh, 15 to 20 calls a day. The winter weather has already wreaked havoc on roads. Whiteout conditions led to multiple accidents on I-90 in Pennsylvania. The interstate was closed so emergency officials could clear the scene. Day one of the Wausau, Wisconsin snowmobile race was canceled because of the extreme weather. We had tremendous cold temperatures and snow dust and the drivers could not see where they're going. As the polar vortex plunges into the U.S., meteorologists say it will be warmer in parts of the Arctic than in Chicago and Minneapolis. We're about to experience a seven-day period of time of uh, both snow and freezing weather. With the wind chill, parts of Illinois and Iowa could hit negative 35. Parts of Wisconsin and Minnesota could dip as much as 45 below. Mark Liverman, CBS News. And the polar vortex rarely plunges as far south as the United States. The last big plunge was in January of 2014 when Chicago's temperature dipped to minus 16 degrees.